in the last video we saw how the while loop works so this time is a counter control repetition how we can control the repetition of the while loop we need some variables there int total int total equal to zero and copy this line okay so total and that is the counter counter starts from the one and the last is a value value is equal to zero okay and there is a while loop so while the counter C O U N T E R while the counter is less than equal to maybe ten, then what it must do? I want to give a user prompt so he can write a number, he can type any number there, and that number he will type make it maybe five five times. Okay. Control dot control right line message will be please please enter a value. Semicolon and whatever value user will put I want to store into a value the value is going to equal to uh, now the well, I need to convert that value into a uh, int so how to convert Convert dot to int dot to int thirty two and console dot read line. So there I'm going to read that value from the user and assign to a value total equal to total, total plus the value the user have input <coughs> and the last is the I have to increment the counter by one counter plus one and after when this whole process done have to come out from the uh, this loop control dot right line and total and BER total total numbers or Tal. Okay. So let's run that. Okay, please enter a value. First value is a two and three and two five. Five and five going to be a ten. And it's just a finish. Uh, actually, we want to see the last result. 
so what I'm going to do is uh, console dot read key So there is the total number is all 25 and it execute 5 times 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and the last is a total number or what's the result 25. So that's how you can control your loop and if you want the certain input from the user so then you can use this method to increment counter by 1 and you can just limit the user he must enter the value 5 times 3 times or 2 times whatever